Um, hi guys, so today I have a really really special project to share with you um, because in this video I made my own engagement dress without realizing it uh, but yeah this video is a bit on the tutorial -y side it's definitely not very vloggy I kept it very simple so it's a good video if you're actually planning to make this dress um, because it, it kind of guides you step by step and if you're wondering uh, this is the dress yes I'm wearing it right now now without further ado let's jump to very unaware me uh, giving you the steps on what to do okay so I started by cutting out all of the elements for the dress the first thing was the classic circle skirt then I cut out this wobbly shape for the puff sleeves and lastly the front and back panels then I watched the invisible zipper tutorial about five times while sewing it in because for some reason I just couldn't make any sense of it but once I finally got it I ended up with this clean seamless back. I then sewed in the darts on both sides of the front panel and tried it on to see if it fit before I sewed all the top panels together. I cut off the excess fabric from the back and opted for the French seam for a cleaner look. I then measured how low I wanted the armholes to make it even on both sides and started sewing in the sleeves. I then took the elastic and wrapped it around my arm to measure how much I needed and marked the spot to cut later. I took one end of the elastic and sewed it tight to the part attached to the top using a mini zigzag stitch. I proceeded to sew the top of the sleeve shut with the elastic inside and once I finished I pulled on it until I saw the purple mark where I cut and sewed the end like I did with the first one. By the way, I am using the narrow zigzag for most of this project as this fabric is uh, slightly stretchy so I don't want any threads to snap. Here I used it to better secure the elastic so it wouldn't jump out the first time I put it on. Right now you can see me putting a basting stitch along the top of the skirt and bunching it up to create more volume. I tried it with the top, cut out the zipper hold and sewed it into the skirt. And then at the very end just sewed the top to the skirt and the rest is history. Here's the ring. I must say he did a really good job with the ring. Um, I just, I absolutely love it. I never wear rings um, and this one I've worn ever since and it's been four months now. Oh yeah, and I was supposed to show you the photos, so here they are. I should probably post them on like Instagram and everywhere since my boy, um, fiance is so very talented and he took so many beautiful photos of me, of us, of the ring, of just the place and yeah it's just oh, he's the best. I hope you like the dress, hope you like the video, I hope you can go and make your own if you like and yeah I will see you in the next one. Bye!